Hey everyone, all right, I think this is the uh, seventh shift. So a lot of learning uh, tends to be product focused, right? It's very shallow, they don't really have time to reflect. Uh, students uh, are moving from class to class, they're moving from subject to subject, and this is typically what it looks like, right? Um, when it comes to reflection, you don't really have time for reflection because you're moving on so quickly. And the, typically the first thing parents are gonna ask is, hey, what grade did you get in school? What was your final grade? Even though we don't really have much evidence as to what was behind that grade, it's very much focused on that grade, uh, as we just talked about. But what if it was more process focused? And you're gonna see some pictures here of the learning experience that shows the depth of it. What if there are different points here within the learning experience for reflection. So as they were going through, they were learning more and more and going deeper and deeper. Of course, they can't answer the question um, of how do we govern and feed ourselves right away, but as they're gaining more knowledge, they're reading texts, uh, they're watching videos, they're discussing, they're going to be very process focused and have the time that it's going to take to come out the other end and be successful. And one of the greatest ways to do that, if you're looking for a strategy, is to uh, put together these student portfolios um, that really demonstrates how they can grow. That's one of the things that we did as well, um, is give them the opportunity to reflect at many stages. So how might you move learning to be more reflective and process-oriented over product-oriented?